Hello everybody, I'm Brian with Servo City and I'm back to show you a whole range of brand new products we have for you today, so let's start right out. First thing I want to show you is a new servo from Hitech called the HSR2645. Now the CR stands for continuous rotation and the neat thing about the servo is it offers metal gears, dual ball bearings, and it's digital. And the digital aspect of a continuous rotation servo is what makes it really, really interesting. One of the things you can do on this is not only set the dead band, but you can also set the perimeter at which it, the speed range is. So what does that necessarily mean? It means you can make this thing run extremely smooth. A lot of continuous rotation servos out there, you, you can't set the dead band, you can't set the speed range, and so um, you kind of get whatever you get out of the box. So not the case with the 2645. You can set the range at which it ramps up and ramps down for those uh, really uh, accurate projects you're trying to do or you need a good speed range, this is a servo that you need to take a look at. So anyway, there's a lot more things that this servo can do, so just be sure to check servocity.com and check under the 2645CR servo and click on that link and you can find out all the specifications on this servo. So moving on is next, should say, we have a cup. well, Actually, they're the same same gear motor, but one has a mount and one does not have a mount. But brand new 140 RPM right angle gear drive motors. Now, these motors offer two output shafts, one on either side. It also offers a longer shaft coming out the back side of the motor, which we'll get into at a at, a, at another video talking about some optical encoders you can put on the back. But these motors are really neat. They pull very low amp draw. Um, you can see here we have a new mount, new Delra mount on the side. You can buy them. They'll come this way right here, or you can also just buy the mount separately. The mount simply screws right on with two 440 uh, pan head screws. Neat thing about this mount is that now you can bolt it onto all the Actobotic components. So, for example, you've got your beams. You can go on either, either direction with the beams. You've got the mini channel bolt directly right onto the mini channel, as well as the larger standard channel you can go several different configurations on the inside, on the outside, lots of different ways. But also, all of the other Actobotic smaller components can bolt right on as well. So if you want to mount tubing on it, other shafts, other different mounts, it can be easily be done. Also, we have a line of new wheels that actually go onto these or, uh, gear motors as well. So basically these will just press fit right on, just like that. Put two of them on either side, like that as well. So these are our smaller, and these are actually made with real rubber, so don't get these confused with some of them out there that, are, that have plastic tires. These are actually rubber tire. And of course, we, then we have our new 3.1 inch wheels also, and these simply press right on as well. And these actually, these wheels here, they'll actually come with a screw that'll actually uh, tighten them onto the gear motor shaft. And then one more feature of these wheels, which is really neat, is on the opposite side, they actually feature a 25-2 spline. So they'll fit on, you know, your Futaba servos, they'll fit on any high-tech servos that actually have the 25-2 spline. So they'll go right on, just like that. Screw will go on the end go right on your servo. So these tires are really neat just for the fact that they have offer really good traction. They can climb really well, dirt, grass, carpet. So, and so what can you do with these combination of motor and wheels? Well, you can build all kinds of things out of the Actobotic line. You can see here we grabbed some, just took a kind of a, well, halfway decent length of uh, channel here. You can put them this way. You can also put them upright on channel. So, and one thing I forgot to mention is the fact that they also, as they dangle in here, you've got 12-inch uh, power leads uh, pre-soldered onto the motors, on the gear motors. They also have, already have your, your pins, which are work out fantastic for just simply mounting right into breadboard, so they're ready to go. So anyway, that's what I had for you today. Uh, be sure to check out servocity.com and check out all these new products. And... Once again, we really appreciate you watching our videos, and if you like this video, please look down below and uh, click on the like button, and don't forget to subscribe to uh, future videos. So take care, we'll see you real soon.